Hello, welcome back. This is Esan again. In this video, we are going to write our first Carol program. This program or this problem that we are going to try to solve using Java language. Uh, so this problem is inspired from a, a similar problem designed at Stanford University. Uh, so we are going to use that their initial idea and going to expand it to something a little more general. Uh, you'll understand what I mean by that, but uh, you don't have to really understand all these details. But let's see <clears throat> what we are talking about. So remember that we created this new uh, Carol environment something which looked like this. Uh, so if we go here, we see that our problem was like this, that Carol was facing east, which is in this direction, east. Uh, uh, two steps forward, it can find a beeper. Three steps forward, it reaches a wall position. Then we need to make Carol go up, take it here, facing east, meaning this location and then place the beeper over here and move till to the end of the wall so that was that is our problem statement in order to solve this problem what we have to do is we are going to use the basic carol instructions which are as we know the following four carol can basically do move it can do turn left it can do pick beeper it can put beeper. These are the four commands Carol understands. So let's play with these four commands and solve the problem that we were talking about. Taking Carol through this, uh, walking, making Carol walk along this street, pick the beeper, move to the end of the street, uh, to the wall. When it reaches the wall, it goes up. Then it turns again to face east place the beeper somewhere here, not somewhere here, exactly here, then it starts moving again towards east and ends at this point facing east. So let's close this and run this, or we can actually put it on this side so that we know what we are doing. Okay, so what do we want to do? First, we want to <coughs> make Carol move. So initially Carol moves, so it goes from here to here, then we move again move so now carol is over here in this location then what we do is we basically know that there is a beeper over here we pick the beeper so now carol is here we have picked the beeper so the beeper is in the bag of carol it doesn't show in the grid anymore we move again and then what happens is carol is over here facing east now it cannot move any further because there is a wall. So what we need to do is we need to somehow make Carol turn up, meaning facing north. For that, what we can do is we can do turn left, which will make Carol uh, face north. Initially, it was facing east. If we do turn left, it will face north. So it turns left. Then Carol is facing north along this direction. We make one move, Carol is now at this location. Then we do another move, Carol is right now in this position. At this point, we need to make Carol move along this road. But Carol is facing north. But we actually want Carol to face east, which is basically not turn left, but it is turn right. So in order to turn right, what we do is basically what we can do is we can make Carol move or sorry, we can make Carol turn left three times. So it was initially facing north. If we make it turn left, now it is facing in this direction, which is west. Then we make it turn left again. Uh, turn left. So now it's basically facing uh, south and then we do turn left again. Now it basically, now it faces east. So now with this three turn lefts, lefts, we have made Carol literally move right. Then 
we make Carol is at this position facing east. Now we make it move one step. So make it move one step and then we place the beeper, meaning put the beeper. And then we make one move, two move, three move, four move, five move. So what we can do is we can basically copy these two moves, paste and then just move. Now, it seems that the algorithm is working fine. Just to help you understand, we are going to put some comments here, which says, turn right. Uh, uh, yeah. So this part of the code is just for the human readability. The computer, when it sees these two uh, expressions, are the two forward slashes it understands that this is not a code but something that only is for the human reader as we have talked before a uh, computer program is not only for the computer to understand it is also for the humans to understand so uh let's save this file uh, i hope you understand everything so first we make two moves one move two move pick the beeper move we have in this position then we <coughs> make this left to turn uh, left to face north. Uh, then we move up the stairs or wall. And uh, so one move, two move. So we have climbed up the stairs. Uh, move or basically we can say climb up the stairs so we are now here then we turn right to face east uh, then we uh, move to reach this position uh, let me put it here move and then we put the beeper the beeper is here and then we move to wall so we were here one move two move three move four move five move so we are now moving towards the wall so let's save this file we remove this double click on this we save the file we run it and let's see if carol works start program it works it works it works voila thank you